Hi Pisces, welcome to your reading and this is for Pisces Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus placement in their chart. Jupiter may resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. Cross watchers, if I describe someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you. Just because you are connecting with Pisces, you're gonna assume that who I'm describing here is you. Please don't, this is not a personal reading. For those of you who's new to the channel, welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And in the live stream, you can ask me questions. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There's a link in the description box. Click that link, you'll be routed to my page type in your questions and then click submit 500 likes for this video and your next videos will be a full reading so pisces if you would love to know your lucky numbers and lucky color follow me on instagram if you also want to know your financial forecast then follow me on instagram as well if you are into twin flame readings almost personal readings pick a card and channel messages Please subscribe to the other channel that is Timeless Tarot 111. And if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, you can come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So, Pisces, I would appreciate if you can click the subscribe like and share at sa mga kababayan natin pakiclick na lang din po ang subscribe like and share so Pisces is your card 10 of cups and your card again the moon card and the death card so it has been you know the, the, there is a lot of questions in this connection or at least someone um, on this person's um, on this side right uh, cross watchers if you feel like you are if this is if this is your reading this side is your reading that's okay um, and Pisces so do you as well of course this is for your for you I can really see that things has been said and done already no well no relationship is perfect even you know family relationships um, I can see that with the moon card you know probably there's really a lot of questions from the past um, questions from the present you know things that this person did or doing um, Someone here feels that someone at least feels that there's a secret, you know. Um, I can I can really see that there is some strangeness with the other person's activity. The other person is probably just in a kind of in a mental state of there's a lot of questions I'm paranoid but I can really see that those changes see here's what happened if you have been um, abused if you have been in a relationship that's in and out and you see some changes that's kind of everything is being placed together you're having these questions right um, you're you are now having a question of is there really something going on right why is my person giving me all of this abundance, giving me all of this um, attention, affection. 
Now, everything that your person is doing right now becomes a question to you, right? Because it's not them. It's not them. Although the, the, the things that are happening are really good, but it is not them. But just so you know, the person on this side, they are really focused now in this connection. That's true. They truly wanted to be together. Remove all those questions. Singles, I can sense here that there's already a disconnection with you and your, um, with a person, you know, the apple of your eye. Now, you let them be. For a small percentage, you let this connection go. Then all of a sudden, you know, the person that you're interested in is coming back. And now the question is, why? It feels like almost crazy to you because when you are the one who's putting an effort to your person, they're not even saying a thing. They're, they're not even putting any pinch of care, putting any pinch of um, empathy, right? So you let them be. Now they're doing these things. Kind of like there's a change in the role. And now you're questioning, although like what I mentioned earlier, things that's happening are in your favor, but you are asking a question now, right? Why? What's with the change? Well, it could just be the Jupiter it retrograde in, 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 your, in your house, right? Pisces. Uh, for those who are in a relationship, see, because of this retrograde emotions, remember Pisces, um, artistic side, emotion side, that will be in your favor. Um, so this is a blessing from the retrograde. For those who are in a relationship, you know that there is a history with your person. Kind of like you know that they are a cheater. They are doing something behind back. Probably you discovered it way then, and now you're kind. And now you're thinking, is it re is it happening again? Right? But no, it's not. Right? The moon card here, followed by the temperance and the Ten of Swords, you know, I can sense that this person wanted to remove all of your, all of the clouds in your head. Um, probably they also wanted to clear the names. That is true. They wanted to clear the, their names. Uh, with the Seven of Swords here, Ace of Cups, followed by the Devil card. Well, I can sense probably in the past there is really some infidelity that um, happened. Uh, but I can really see here they really changed. The amount of love now is in really incomparable from the way that they feel. So the intensity the level of their emotion increased. So congratulations, Pisces. Um, if this is you, or cross-watchers, congratulations. If this is you, this, you feel like this is your reading. Um, however, the person on this side, mm, they saw how fun this person is. They saw how beautiful this person is as time passes by. You know, sometimes we don't appreciate a thing, a person, when we just met them or we just had them. But we tend to like and love them more, right, in, in due time. Um, I can see here that with the Seven of um, Pentacles here, that they are actually... 
waiting for someone it may sound so cliche right but this is what's really i am i'm hearing like the adele song someone they're really waiting for someone like you um but they cannot believe it at first so they think that you might be you know just a person that's too good to be true but because pisces right if you truly love a person you give your all so uh, from what I'm seeing here there's no person like this who can give their emotion who can um, wear their hearts on their sleeves right so from that separation probably you had a separation whether it is physical or energetic they missed you they feel hurt and they never um, expected that they could you know feel like this for someone there's a lot of new beginning new experiences from them there's a lot of new things that you let them um, that, that, that you opened from them for them and they were amazed by how how fun you are you're not just beauty brain but you are a person of a sub uh, person of substance um, with this seven of coins you know page of wands and the sun I think that you're this person also the sun showed up here on both sides right it may sounded this kind of like this story is from rugs to riches right <laughs> From negative to light um, and Pisces this is really a colorful colorful um, connection I can see here that stars are aligning for both of you kind of like things are shuffled um, so that you can be both see each other's uh, negativities see each other's differences and work on it right spiritually you give them a lot of enlightenment so when you got separated i can see here that there's a lot of hurt with a king of swords and a nine of pentacles this person may not even saying it to you verbally you know um verbally opened but they already made a wise decision they're not going to say it but you are their happiness they really have a huge amount of love um, and for them they are really taming all of those bad behaviors you know and trying to change their their old ways so you might be connecting with the same sign pisces all right or you might be connecting with a scorpio or has a scorpio placement in their chart or you have a scorpio placement in your chart sagittarius or has a sagittarius placement in their chart or you have a sagittarius placement in your chart taurus or has a taurus placement in their chart or you have a taurus placement in your chart um, Capricorn or has a Capricorn placement in their chart or you have a Capricorn placement in your chart Leo or has a Leo placement in their chart or you have a Leo placement in your chart but this is your reading if you resonate with this and you want to go in depth you can book a personal reading with me if you are okay with the reading and you just have a question or two there's a link in the description box click that link you'll be routed to my page type in your questions and then click submit 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading thank you so much for watching love and light to you namaste see you on the next reading pisces goodbye